Hi there and welcome to another Postman Tips and Tricks tutorial. My name is Valentine and in this video I wanted to show you how you can generate how Faker.js calls it massive amounts of fake data in your application when using Postman. So in Postman you only get like a few predefined variables that you can use and now with the latest Postman version, version 7.2, you can generate different kind of data. And I just wanted to give you a few examples. So for example, here I can generate a random first name. I can generate a random bank account. I can generate a random phone number. And the way they look is something like this in this case. And there's a long list of all this data you can now generate in Postman and use in your test to have this random data uh, in your applications, in your test. You can use it right away and I will highly recommend that you take a look into this. Now to get the entire list of all these variables, I will highly recommend that you download the Postman Quick Reference Guide. You will find a link as a resource to this lecture in the description. So download that and check out what kind of variables you can now use in Postman. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more tutorials like this. See you next time. Bye bye.